Hey Pop Culture Pals, I'm here with a little quickie today. I got this lanyard full of Disney pins from Whatnot. I bought it at the very end of the auction. I came in just as the auction was ending, so I didn't even know what I was getting other than I saw this Star Wars pin and saw that there was a lot of pins, and I bid. I want to say, I think with shipping, I paid under $15 for the entire thing. So some of them I'll keep, some of them I'll resell and hopefully be able to make back what I spent on them. If you're interested in any of these pins, let me know or come over to Boris Basement on eBay. They will be listed shortly. We're gonna start right here with this one. This is, there's a lot of Star Wars pins on here. This is Goofy as Darth Vader. It's one of those dimensional pins. Um, you know, I know they've got dates and things on the back, but boy, they're hard for my little eyes to read. So we're just gonna take a look and move forward. Next, I actually quite like this one. It's Monsters, Inc. Sully and Mike. And again, it's a 3D ornament. Uh, ornament, listen to me. It's a 3D pin. Bigger pin, almost an inch or more. Really cute. This is a favorite that I'll probably be keeping, even though I think it does sell for a bit. This is one of the Mickey Jack-O-Lanterns for Halloween. I do love my Disney Halloween. It looks like it's a glow in the dark. I think the eyes and the mouth glow. And again, really cute design. I don't know if you can see the year on it, but um, that one I think is gonna go in my collection. Here's another Mickey ears, but it's not a pumpkin. This I believe is the Galactic Empire uh, pin uh, symbol. And then again on Mickey ears. We've got Buzz Lightyear, speaking of the galaxy. Uh, he's just kind of playing. I don't know if he's got much value. These simple, these simple um, character ones don't seem to do as well. Another Star Wars uh, Sith Lords? I don't know. Figure, correct that one for me. Um, but again, it's a typical Star Wars logo, but combined with the Mickey ears. Kind of cool. Here's another really crazy Star Wars one. This is that evil Stitch, I think he's got a different name, but I can't remember what it is. So sorry, Stitch fans, that I'm calling him the wrong thing. But he's as um, dressed up as Emperor Palpatine, I'm thinking, right? How's my Star Wars? And beautiful background on this one, like he's in the Death Star looking out the window. Really neat pin. Again, even like from the bottom, the way he's standing, dimensional. If I was the keeper of Star Wars pins, I might hang on to that one because it's pretty darn cool. Another Star Wars. This is the Jedi Academy pin with Mickey uh, battling Goofy Darth Vader. I keep wanting to call him Pluto. And uh, so it's what? Mickey is Obi-Wan, right? And they are battling against another dimensional pin. This one's a little more simple, but certainly a little more rare. A nice X-Wing. Pin. And again, the way it's laid out, it's pretty cool. It gives it some shape, even though it technically isn't dimensional. Uh, it's also kind of almost like a photo realistic version. Um, pretty neat. One more Star Wars. Here's Mickey as, again, get me on my Star Wars people. Um, I'm saying Obi-Wan. I suppose it could be Luke, but mm, that robe is Obi-Wan, right? He's got his lightsaber and he's looking stinky. He's ready for battle. Here's a little more generic participation pin from 2008, probably from either a run or some other Mickey volunteer event. These randomly do and don't have some value depending if someone was at this event and lost their pin, they might want it. Here's another hidden Mickey as they call them pin. Um, I'm assuming again that it's uh, for Japan. So it's probably an Epcot pin for Epcot. Um, in Walt Disney World, Mickey ears with what I'm assuming again is a Japanese flag. Got a couple of my favorites coming up. This one is a keeper for me. This is the Pirates of the Caribbean compass coin. Big one. Again, over an inch, large pin. Very cool. Super detail. Looks great. And on the opposite side of that, we have this one. We have two real small pins. This one, now I thought when I first glanced at it that it was some kind of Indiana Jones pin, but it actually is the Pirates of the Caribbean compass again, but with, oh, so I can't get it to adjust. There we go. Um, it's Pirates writing with Chinese characters at the bottom. Um, it's a much smaller pin, 
it's you can see by comparison the size of the two pins very little a little bit harder to see but quite unusual this is a really tiny one i was i don't know that i've ever seen disney pins this small unless they've come in some kind of a set this is a tomorrowland i think this is the astro orbiter is what it's called but again very small if you look at it in comparison there's the big pirates one there's the pin uh, so I don't know if this was put out for some kind of special event or part of a set because it is a mini pin. No, no, no pun intended as far as I'm concerned. And then we have really funny, the Twilight Zone Tower of Terror pin. I actually already have this pin and I think I actually have it up for sale with some other Tower of Terror merchandise on eBay with all the pins there are in the world of Disney. So funny that I have this one again. And we're going to finish uh, with, I can't remember where we started. I don't think we saw this one yet. One more Pirates of the Caribbean. So help me out on this one again, folks. My understanding, when I look at this, I get Funko and it's Davy Jones, right? From the Pirates movies. It's not Barbosa. Uh, I've looked him up though that way and I'm not finding anything about him online. So... I'm assuming he's a legit pin. All of these pins look like they have all the proper Disney markings on the back, if that helps you at all. I can't quite, again, it's so small. 2004, maybe? Um, but is there another name for this pin that I'm missing? The reason I can't find him. Let me know. So of this set, that's a favorite. I think this is my all time favorite, this Mickey pumpkin pin. I have a Mickey pumpkin like this, a big one for Halloween decor. Those would be my two favorites. What's your favorite pin of all of these? Or your favorite pin that you have from your Disney collection? Let me know. And if you're interested in buying them, hit me up here or come visit me at Boris Basement.